Well, today for the capacitor bank, I've got these crummy old circuit boards, no really good salvage on them, so they may as well provide a little entertainment before they go into the garbage looking a little more charred and burnt than they do now. Well, this first board has some capacitors on it, so let's have a go. Charged, and, and there goes one capacitor. Charged, and charged, and charged, and. Another electrolytic gone. Oops, that moved the thing away. Ah, just one more little cap left to go on this board. Let's give it a shot. That one right there. Charge and fire. Ooh. Charged and fire. Charged and fire. Charged and fire. Fire. And fire again. Ah. Lost contact. Okay, this one's finished. This next board is from a pocket radio and isn't terribly interesting for salvage, so let's see if it's interesting uh, with the capacitor bank. Let's give it a few shots. Well, that's had a few shots.
Well, here's another boring old uh, radio board. Let's give it a couple of shots. Charged. Oops. Okay, the connection's back. Let's keep going. Charge. Now let's try connecting in a different place. Charged. Ah, there goes that IC from the front, finally. Well, this one should be pretty toasted. Well, this last board doesn't have much on it at all, but there are some really, really old electrolytics on it, so let's give it a go. Charged. Well, I'll hit these old electrolytics a few more times, we'll see. I'm not going to give up for a couple more shots. Charged.
Ah, seems to be losing its connections. Well, 75 microfarads at 6400 volts blow an 8 amp fuse. Ah, let's find out. Charged. Yes, it did blow the fuse. Ah, this bank is now so loud I had to use uh, hearing protectors. It's getting deafening to use this thing. Well, these nasty old circuit boards at least provided a little entertainment before they hit the garbage. Some of the electrolytics were just so old and so dry, there was no popping them. All the electrolytics did on this board was bulge a little bit, but maybe that's not so surprising. This board is probably more than 40 years old, so... Those things must be pretty dry. A couple of the electrolytics did pop and fly off, 